Stay back from me, foul beast. You will not terrorize. Oh! You are now part of my pack. What was that fell beast? I must get out of here. I have to get somewhere safe. Oh my god, what the hell are you? You shall join my pack. I will never join you, evil beast. Oh. There is no choice. Yeah, well, let me think about it, okay? I mean, I don't know if I really want to join the band right now. Don't leave us hanging too long, Ash. Come on. You've got great vocals. We need you. Yeah, well, I'm only 18 years old. I mean, I've still got my whole life ahead of me. I don't even know what I want to do yet. Yeah, well, you know the offer is always open. Whenever you want. We'll take you. Thanks, I appreciate that. I've really got to go. <sighs> I don't understand what the hell do you want from me. What are you? I'm a werewolf, and now so are you. Nice, what a hilaria. Stay back. Now you two are a part of my pack, and my power will grow. I'm gonna miss you, father. I will try to be the man that you want me to be. Oh my god, what the hell are you? I want you to join my back, Deke. I see your sadness. I can give you a family. Why in the hell do you think I'd want to have a family like yours? Because you will live for a long time and you will never die. Except for one way. But we will protect you. <sighs> I cannot believe my father sent me away. I hate him. I will never return. Oh my god, what in the hell was that? Oh, what are you? Stay back. You will become a part of my pack. <sighs> I don't know what's chasing me. What is that? I have to hide. I have to stay out of sight. There is no hiding, child. I can smell you. Oh my god, what are you? What do you want from me? You will become part of my pack. Forever. Now to find more so I can be even more powerful and take out the hunters. You're going down, too dark and ugly. A try hunter. Time to take you guys down. Ever. <laughs> Alright, Victor. It's time to take you down once and for uh, It will not happen today, Hunter. Oh my god, what are you? You're a werewolf. My father warned me about you. Please, Rick, do not fear me. I want you to join my pack. Oh my god, Jeremiah, is that you? Uh. Yes, it is. And you are going to be part of my pack. You're not giving me a choice. Yes, I am sorry for that, but I was never given a choice either. Besides, you will enjoy the power. Holy crap, monsters really do exist. I gotta hide. Daniel, do not fear me. You will become part of my pack. Daria, are you saying you want me to join your pack? No way. Daniel, I am offering you strength beyond your wildest dreams, and you will never die, and never get sick. Yeah, that all sounds well and good until the part about being a werewolf and killing people. We do not kill blindly, Daniel. We only kill those that deserve it. Doesn't matter what I say, I don't have a choice. Oh, hey, Jeremiah. You wanted to meet with me? What's this all about? 
I have been watching you for a while, Will. I think I have an offer for you that you might be interested in. Oh, you want me to join your little pack there? I don't know if I'm interested in being a werewolf. You have seen the power that we command. You could be part of that. Yeah, well, who says I'm a bloodthirsty killer? Please, Will, I can see it all over you. You are a killer. Now you could be a powerful one. You do make a good point. I'll write him in. I haven't seen you around here before. What can I get you? Actually, Jack, I wanted to talk to you. There's something I can help you with. I'm sorry, help me with. How do you know my name? Who the hell are you? My name is Jeremiah, and I am a werewolf, and I would like to make you one to save your life. Excuse me, did you say werewolf? Then why would I need you to save my life? Because you're about to discover that you have cancer that is irreversible. I can protect you from that. Hey, could you possibly know that? I haven't even been to the doctor yet. Just the blood work. Part of the power I offer. Oh, they are definitely going to regret firing me. I'll make them pay. Yes, Katie, you absolutely will make them pay. Because I will help you. I'm sorry, but who the hell are you? And how can you make anybody pay? My dear, have you ever heard of werewolves? Would you like to become one? You would have great power. You would be unmatched. Yeah, okay, buddy. Well, if that was true, I'll take you up on it. And then I'll come back here and take out those creeps upstairs. Of course you will, and your back will help you. Well, damn, I'd hate to see the other guy. My name is Dr. Strollen. Yes, Marvin, I know exactly who you are. I have a proposition for you. Okay, look, I don't know who you've been talking to, but I am a straight doctor, okay? Please, Marvin, we both know that is a lie. Besides, I want to offer you a job where you don't have to worry about losing your license for any reason. Okay, how did you know I was going to lose my license? Because I have been watching you for a while, doctor. Okay, what's your offer? Ah, you don't have to worry, I'm telling you. These two are going to be together, and they're going to protect the rest of us. Yeah, no, Arya, I believe you. I mean, I know your power of sight is great, but a werewolf and a vampire protecting us? They are no ordinary werewolf or vampire. They have been through a lot, and they understand. Yeah, well, I definitely hope you're right, because the hunters and probably the angels are not going to go for this. Trust me, once they see it for themselves, they're going to believe it. Yeah, I definitely hope you're right. Yes, well, I must be the one to go down to Earth. I will speak to the hunters, find out the situation. Yes, I agree with that, but please be careful. So, what do you really think about all this? Think we need to go down there? Oh, I'm completely sure that we'll eventually have to go down there. Humans always screw everything up. Even the demonic ones. I'm sorry, but I have faith in them. I think that we'll be surprised. Yes, well, humans never cease to amaze us, but I doubt a werewolf and a vampire could be good. I don't know, I think that math test was really brutal. How do you think you did? Are you kidding me? I totally fa failed it. I don't know, but I feel like somebody's been watching me. I, I see this guy. He's really creeping me out. Yeah, well, you know what? That's really crazy because I think somebody's following me too. Yeah, well, I think you guys are just being completely paranoid. There's nobody following us. Why would they? No, I think they're right. I feel like somebody's been following me too and I've been having really bad dreams. Me too. Well, I believe the boy is my son. I need to find out for sure. Yes, well, there's also some other rumors out there about another wolf. A lone wolf. We need to find him too. Yes, well, this is not a good time for Ash to be disappearing on me. I need the complete pack. I would not worry, Victor. I'm sure whatever is going on with him, it will be temporary. I'm sorry, I do not think that is the case, old friend. I think he has fallen in love with someone. And I can tell by the look on your face, it is not another wolf. Is it a human? I don't know yet. Ah, so you wanted to see me. Is everything all right? No, oh, yeah, Max, everything's fine. Just been waiting all day to do that. Yeah, well, I don't mind that. It's very nice. Look, I don't want to freak you out. I have never felt this way about anybody. Wolf or otherwise. You're not freaking me out, us. I've never felt this way about anyone. Ever. Okay, great. Now that we've established that, what the hell are we going to do about it? I've tried to reason with my father, but there's no going there. Do you think Victor would be okay with this? Honestly, no. But I don't give a damn. Well, damn, it definitely looks like you two have fallen in love. So what's the next step? Honestly, I was hoping you could help me with that. I've never even been on a date. 
Oh, damn, are you telling me that you're a virgin for 338 years? That's what I was taking care of my mother when I was alive. And I never met anyone that I wanted to be with until him. Well, I'll do what I can to help you. I'm happy for you, really. Thank you for that. I just wish you weren't the only one.